breaking news about a plane crash in Tennessee involving NASCAR star Dale Earnhardt Jr. CNN's Diane Gallagher has been gathering details for us. Uh, Diane, what are you learning? Yeah, so Wolf, on that plane were five people, including that two-time Daytona 500 winner Dale Earnhardt Jr., as well as his wife, Amy Earnhardt, and their one-year-old daughter, Isla. They were two crew members, two pilots there as well. According to the FAA and the police office, the police chief there in Elizabethton, Everybody got out okay. The police chief says that when they came on scene that the plane was on fire, flames coming out of it. It burned for about 20 minutes, but all the people on the plane were already outside of it. Now, according to Dale Earnhardt Jr.'s sister, Kelly Earnhardt, uh, he and his wife, everybody on board, have been taken to the hospital uh, just for precautionary measures to get checked out, but said that everyone is safe. Now, the FAA has said that this is a Cessna citation, that it rolled off the end of the runway 24 there and then caught fire after landing. The NTSB is going to determine uh, the probable cause of the accident, but look, Junior is an analyst for NBC Sports. He talks about NASCAR, the races in Bristol this weekend. This is very close to Bristol, and he was taking his family there to start work. He's a retired driver, retired back in 2017, Wolf, uh, one most popular driver in NASCAR, 15 years in a row, and, of course, two Daytona 500s. A lot of people outside of the world know him as being the, the intimidator, Dale Earnhardt's son, who died in that 2001 Daytona 500 crash. And we're certainly happy all of them are fine. Yeah. Uh, Diane, thank you very much. Now. There's a baby in there. There might be. Yeah, that dude just pulled a baby out of there. It's a private jet. And a dog. Because it's a private jet. They're probably just on a trip somewhere. Oh, there's someone like still in there. I need to get their dog. everybody out? Yeah, I think that guy said everybody was out. Somebody's on the ground over there. That fire's picking up. Yeah. the fire department. Wait, when, they, when they pulled that baby out of there, holy oh, crap.
signal burning on the other side of the road. You see that? It looks like a tire. Good evening, this is our Western Edition, and we're going to begin tonight with breaking news. Dale Earnhardt Jr., one of the biggest names in NASCAR, was involved in a fiery plane crash this afternoon in eastern Tennessee. His wife, baby daughter, and two pilots were also on board. They were all taken to a hospital for evaluation. Earnhardt is 44 years old and known simply as Junior by racing fans. He was in Tennessee to work as a TV analyst for this weekend's NASCAR race. Omar Villafranca on how his family and dog escaped. Flames and black smoke poured out of the Cessna Citation jet just moments after the plane ran off the runway in Northeast Tennessee. On board, racing legend Dale Earnhardt Jr. Seen here being treated at the scene by paramedics, his wife Amy, their daughter Isla, and two pilots. Video from the scene shows five people, even the family dog, somehow walking away from the accident. Well, a large, rather large frame as you can imagine, but uh, you know, your first thing when you look at that, I think uh, there's, it's not going to be good. Earnhardt's sister Kelly tweeted that everyone is safe and has been taken to the hospital. Earnhardt is part of NASCAR racing royalty. Junior, as he is known, followed in the footsteps of his late father, Dale Earnhardt Sr., racing stock cars. But the family is no stranger to tragedy. Earnhardt Sr., one of the most revered names in all of racing, died at the 2001 Daytona 500 in a crash. Junior continued his career and went on to win the Daytona 500 two times, finally retiring in 2017. Earnhardt and his family were flying into the airport for an event at the nearby Bristol Motor Speedway. Omar Villafranca joins us tonight. And so, Omar, what do we know about the condition of the family? The local hospital says all they have is just minor bumps and bruises. In fact, Junior was awake and talking to paramedics. And Nora, after you see the pictures of that plane crash, it's amazing that anyone made it out alive. Incredible miracle there. Omar Villafranca, thank you.